Okay, you guys, here we go again. So, what's new in 1.4? Um, for me, this is a very nice update because there are some things in there I actually can use as a person who likes to read books on its reader. So, they really did a good job here. Um, for me, basically, the most important thing is um, I have a like if I open up a book, now we got here go to and we finally have the thing go to page which is really nice. Um, you can see you can use the slider and go like this and if you close it down um, it goes to the page you're looking for which goes pretty fast as you can see uh, down here we are on this page uh, works very nice. Um, of course, if you have a book with lots of pages, like 2,000, 3,000 pages, it's pretty hard to find the exact the page you want to go to with a slider. But at least now we have the chance to go to a certain page. So I think this is a very nice improvement. Um, page turn is still great. Um, it's It's pretty fast, as you can see. If I swipe it, yeah, the page turns. I think this has improved a little bit. I'm not quite sure, but it's okay. Like in Germany, we have certain letters that you don't have in, in America. So they, with the last update, they were displayed wrong. Um, but now, at least the, in, the German words are shown correctly. If I go to the library, and like, like this is one of these things, this U. Um, this was, you had funny signs there when you had such a, a letter in there. Um, this problem is solved now, so that's very nice. What is else new? Um, well, they added an extra, extra large font. So um, if you're having trouble with your eye size, side, this is a very nice thing. You can choose now between six fonts, uh, uh, sizes, sorry. So I, I show you, this is the, oops. No, come on. This is the extra small one. Um, as you can see, it resizes pretty fast. So this is itsy bitsy. This is extra small. And now, if you go to extra, extra large, I mean, this is really extra, extra large. As you can see, I mean, you get like one sentence on, on a page. But if you really have trouble with your eyes, this is awesome. I mean, it's crisp, it's sharp, as you can see, and um, it's really large. I usually stay with the medium size. That's okay for my old eyes, <laughs> and I get along with that size really good. You see, the resizing is pretty fast. Um, the page turn is pretty fast, so I think they improved their, they tweaked it there a little bit. Um, Another nice thing for me is um, they took care of the problem if you uh, of the time problem if you live in a daylight um, saving zone. Um, if I go to settings, I am not sure if it was there before. I don't think so because I always had the wrong time in it. So um, if I go now to oops sorry not to device I have to go to display um, and go to clock. You see, now there is um, daylight saving time. I can switch it on and off. So now my Central European time is displayed correct. If I switch it on, there was always um, an hour difference there. Now I, I set the daylight saving times and um, it's displayed correctly. This time I have to say I'm really pr very pleased with the update. Um, they didn't do lots of new things, but what they did were things you can really um, work with. Um, I'm not quite sure about the, the Wi-Fi settings since I'm outside the US. I don't have an AT&T network here. Um, but everything else in this um, in this setup, in, in this new firmware is working for me great. I have a go-to page now which I was really looking for. I have a new text size which is very good for people that have a hard time reading the small letters. Um, it has become a little faster, uh, resizing text and opening up books. 
um, the problem with the wrong displayed characters has been solved, which is nice for people that have these kind of characters in their letters in their um, language. I have a daylight saving time, so now my um, time is displayed correctly. So this is an update I can live with and I really like. And I'm sure they come up with more great updates in the future. And they're really working hard uh, to please us. I mean, they're doing a great job. And this update is for me, thumbs up. This is a good one. Good one. So that's all for now. See you next time. Bye-bye.